Adaptivities every day. Adaptivities adapt and play. You can play with a friend, so much fun till the end. So come, let's start today. Adaptivities. 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 Welcome back, back, adaptive peeps. peeps. Yeah. Today's topic is haircuts. Haircuts. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> so I got a haircut. Um, I think now two months ago. I try to get a haircut every three to four months. I think you and, look and good more. with long hair. Do you? Oh, you know what the funny thing is? I actually like bobs better. Like, I purposely like, I, I like bobs. It just, it frames my face better. But I decided to just kind of let it grow because I really wear my hair curly. And so when it's curly, it shrinks halfway up my face. And so that's why I have longer hair. Um, but I think, I thank you for the compliment. Welcome. You always have great hair, Madeline. Thank you. And I love your, and I love the fact that you have bangs, which is really, really cute. So, I'm going to tell you about a couple experiences with some of my kids. They can't stand getting hair. My brother actually loves having short hair. Okay, why does he love it? And does he, is he okay with, who cuts his hair? Does his dad cut his hair? Actually, he goes to a haircut place. Okay, oh, okay. But he used, he used to have long hair, but when he got a little bit older, mm -hmm. like this is like a long time ago when he had long hair, but when he got a little bit older, he didn't like long hair. Mm -hmm. And... That like a few years ago, if his hair was too long, eh, he would cut his own hair because because he hated the long hair. Oh, I noticed too when his hair, hair is like cut short, like a buzz cut. He likes to put his hands in a little bit, like a, for sensory. Yeah, I guess he likes sensory to feel. Yeah, it feels really good to him when it's shorter. And he also looks handsome when it's kind of short. Yeah. Yeah, he looks so cute. Um, well, he's not cute now. He's older. I'll say he looks handsome. So when you go, so you go to a salon as well, right? Your mom doesn't yeah. cut your hair. Okay. And is it quick? Is it an easy process? Um, well, they take, well, it's, they make it so it looks really good and it's really pleasing. Okay. All right. Yeah. Some of my kids hate going because they, they're, first of all, they're tactile defensive, meaning they don't like to be touched. So going to a hair salon is not an option. And if you're a boy, sometimes they have these things called clippers or cutters and it makes it sound and they cannot stand the sound. So sometimes getting their hair cut, it's, it's really, really hard for some kids with special needs. Um, but I'm glad that you don't mind it and your brother doesn't mind who's, and you both guys are on the spectrum and you both enjoy it. He's on the spectrum a lot more than me. Yeah, and he still likes haircuts, but a lot of kids don't. Yeah. Um, and I don't know what the solution is. If you have any ideas or solutions or how your experiences with your kids getting their haircuts, let us know in the comment section below. We'd love, love to hear from you. Uh, anything else you want to say about haircuts? Or any recommendations or any? No. Okay. Well, that's it. Thanks for watching our adaptive. Bye bye, adaptive peace. See you next week. Thanks for watching another episode of Madeline Monday. Please subscribe and tune in next week for a new episode.